If your vehicle is fitted with rear-only VB air suspension, your controller will look like this and have the following options. The system will only function while the park brake is applied. Controlling the height of your vehicle. To lower the rear of the vehicle, firstly apply the park brake to activate the system. Once activated, press and release the down arrow once and the rear of the vehicle will automatically lower to its lowest point. To lower to a desired height, press and hold the down arrow. Once at the required height, release the button and the air suspension will stop lowering. To raise, press and release the up arrow once and the system will automatically inflate to right height. To raise the rear of the vehicle to a specific height, press and hold the up arrow. Once at your desired height, release the button and the air suspension will stop inflating. Alternatively, simply start the engine and release the park brake. This tells the system you are about to move and automatically inflates to ride height. There will be an audible tone warning the user the system is inflating. It is recommended to wait until the vehicle has reached ride height and the tone is no longer audible before driving. Memory buttons. There are two memory preset buttons, M1 and M2, available on the controller for your convenience. To store a specific height, press and hold the desired memory button until a tone is heard. Your specific height is now stored and easily accessed by pressing the chosen memory button. The system will automatically raise or lower to your stored height. The memory presets will only function while the vehicle is stationary. The service button. The service button is only needed when the vehicle is in a maintenance situation such as servicing, tyre changing and routine maintenance. By pressing the service button, the system is inoperative and will no longer function until the button is pressed again. When in service mode, a red light will appear on the button to indicate the service function is active. To deactivate, the vehicle must be stationary and the park brake applied.